Right now, first round of jury selection is underway in the trial for Michael Slager. Slager, the former North Charleston officer on trial for the shooting death of Walter Scott. News 2's Rebecca Klett has been at the courthouse since early this morning. She's been there all day. Rebecca, tell us about today's proceedings. What happened? Brendan, good evening. Well, it certainly was a long day for jurors. We've just wrapped up day one right around 5.30, 5.45. It's a slow process because there were 600 summons sent out to potential jurors. That did, many people didn't show up today. Only 188 showed up for the roll call, which is the first part of jury selection. The others were either excused or not located. Now, the judge wanted every single name called of those 600, even if they knew they weren't going to be here because he wanted every single name on the record. He wanted this portion of the trial to be by the books and everything documented on the record. Of the 188 who were here, each of them had to stand up, state their name, their marital status, their job status, and their spouse's job status. So that takes a long time to get through all 188 people. At this point, we've heard that 134 are expected to make it into round two which becomes a little more intense. They'll be asked more questions, both from the judge and from the prosecution and the defense attorneys. This story has obviously gathered national attention, and two men today were in town all the way from New Jersey. They said they came here to honor Walter Scott because they were frustrated with the video they saw. We're here standing in memoriam for Walter that, you know, he died for no reason. And it's just blatant hostility towards him, whatever was in that police officer's mind. The roll call portion of this jury selection will continue tomorrow morning around 930. This is expected to take about two days, but today was very slow. So we'll be interested to see how tomorrow plays out. In total, the trial is expected to last somewhere between two and three weeks. I'm downtown Charleston tonight. Rebecca Collette, News 2. Rebecca, thanks. Several civil rights organizations and others gathered today to talk about this trial.